God told Elijah to take Elisha because Elisha was to take his place as the prophet. Pero sabi ng Bible, when Elijah came to Elisha, Elijah didn't call Elisha. Elijah simply passed by Elisha. And the Bible said, Elisha said, if you will let me Kung hahayaan mo, magpaalam ako sa aking mga magulang. 
I will burn all this cloud. So sunugin ko itong pag-aararo, itong araro, and I'm going to follow after you. And that's what Elisha did. And the Bible said he poured water in the hands of Elijah. The word poured water means he served him for every purpose. Sa kahit na anong paraan, he served the prophet because he knew he was serving God. Now listen, Elisha, I mean, Elijah asked Elisha, sabi ni Elijah, anong ibibigay ko sa'yo, hindi ko na mapapasahod? Anong ibibigay ko sa'yo, kapalit ng iyong pagsisilbi? This is what Elisha said. Wala akong hihingi kaya mana ng pera. Hindi ako hihingi ng posisyon o kahit na anumang pabor galing sa'yo. Isa lang ang gusto kong hilingin, sabi ni Elisha. For all my sacrifice and all my service, I want a double portion of your anointing. Now listen, Elisha served Elijah for 10 years. One decade. At ang sabi ni Elijah, pag nakita mo ako, kinuha ng Panginoon, nakita ng dalawa mong mata, then you will have the double portion of my anointing. And so, kahit saan pumunta si Elijah, Elisha was there. Elisha was there to serve. He sacrificed his own dreams. He sacrificed Amen. Yung mama nahin niya sana sa kanyang ama na may kaya, mga kapatid. But he poured water on the hands of Elijah because nothing more mattered to him than the presence of God and a double portion of the power of God upon his life. And on the 11th year, one day they were walking by the river and suddenly a chariot of fire came and picked up Elijah by the chariot of fire and brought Elijah to heaven. And when Elisha looked up, behold, the mantle of Elijah was coming down. Sinalo niya ang mantle, mga kapatid. And when you look at the life of Elisha, Elisha did double, did more than Elijah did. We are going into this brand new decade, 2020. And if it's your desire for God to give you a double portion of what you have from the past 10 years, every day that you had to sacrifice and you had to serve, every tear that you cried, every trial you had to go through, we're going into this brand new year. Brand new brand new and I pray a double portion of anointing upon each of you and upon this church if you desire that lift your hands and praise the Lord and we're going to sing this song again I know that breakthrough is coming and I know that God will work for us for this time of year we're going to tear down the high places in Jesus' name. Sing that again. I know breakthrough is coming. Breakthrough is coming. By faith, by faith, I see a miracle. My God, make me a promise and it won't stop now. I know breakthrough is coming. By faith, I see a miracle. My God, make me a promise and it won't stop now.